Hi, my name is Christine Seymour, and this is my story. My life before knowing Christ was not an easy road. I grew up in a family full of divorce and remarriage, stepbrothers and stepsisters, and all that that life brings on. Our family didn't attend church, but when I was about nine years old, a church bus stopped in front of our house and asked if my sister and I could go to their kids' program, and our mom said yes. It was the first time that we would hear about Jesus' love and experience that love through the people there. We loved going to church, and so the bus would pick us up every Sunday morning. After attending church for a while and hearing about Jesus loving us, even though we were sinners and that he died on the cross for us and rose again, my sister and I both decided to give our lives to Jesus and we wanted to live for him. But we didn't have the support of our parents. They didn't make sure we got up and went to church and eventually we stopped going. At 17, I rebelled and ran away from home to live with my boyfriend. At 20, I was a mess and found myself to be pregnant. At that very time, my sister started coming around and telling me that she had recently given her life back over to Jesus and that I needed to do the same. I knew she was right, and eventually I knew I needed to give my life back over to Jesus, not only for myself, but for my baby girl so that she could have a chance at a good life. So I asked Jesus to forgive me for turning my back on him and that I was ready to live for him again. Since then, my life has never been the same. I'm done with all the drugs and alcohol and all that that lifestyle brings on. It hasn't been an easy road though. I've still had to live with the circumstances of the choices I've made and I still make mistakes along the way. I had two marriages that were abusive and ended in divorce and left me as a single parent. But Jesus has been faithful and has never left me and because of that I've been able to get through the tough times. I never thought that I would remarry, but God saw fit to let me see what it's like to have a marriage the way He intended. I met Lance, and he's a very godly man. He loves Jesus, and it's been so exciting to have someone to serve the Lord and grow together with Him. Romans 8.28 has been my life verse. It's helped me to get through the rough times, and it continues to help me. It says, and we know that all things work together for the good of those who love Him and are called according to His purposes.